Welcome to the Vermeer Armor Drilling System Assembly video. First begin by installing the two O-rings onto the dowels. Then install the chosen bit by aligning the dowels and dovetail sliding rearward until it seats. Next install the solid pin securing the bit to the head, ensuring the chamfered side of the pin is inserted first, only hammering on the radius end of the pin. Use the small multi-tool punch to seat the pin. Finish the installation of the bit by inserting the socket head cap screw, securing the solid roll pin, using the multi-tool hex bit. If utilizing the gauntlet bit, you will next need to install the three conical teeth. Begin by aligning the tooth and gently tapping to start it. Then use the multi-tool to finish seating the tooth, ensuring it will spin upon completion. Repeat this process for the additional two teeth. To remove conical teeth, begin by tapping them out partway with the small multi-tool punch. Then use the tooth hook to finalize removal. Repeat this process for the remaining teeth. To begin sawned installation, insert the nylon timing key in the front of the housing, followed by the bottom sawned isolators. Be sure to install the narrow sawned isolators in the front and the wide in the rear. Next install the sond, ensuring the timing slot aligns with the timing key. Then install the top sond isolators. Install the heavy duty sond lid by lowering the front end first, then lowering the rear. Finally slide the lid backwards to seat. Once you have slid the sawn lid backwards, install the roll pin by using a hammer. Finish by tapping the roll pin to the center of the housing using the large multi-tool punch. Finally insert the sawn lid socket head cap screw into the housing using the multi-tool hex bit. Your armor system assembly is now complete. 